Where are we heading today? Uh, we're Big going mountain. to Nine Mile. Nine Mile, and what are your expectations? Uh, a lot of climbing. <laughs> Hopefully keep it pointed in the right direction. Which way is that? Up. And what about on the way down? Oh yeah, but you gotta get up before you can go down. <laughs> I ride dirt bikes because it's so much fun and there's always a challenge every day there's something new to try and learn and fall on. Well, I got into dirt biking because I wanted a moped. I had wanted a moped forever. My husband said, oh no, 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 it's never going to make it up the hill to the house. He said, let's try dirt bikes. Neither of us had ever ridden before. Um, so he took me down to the shop and we were looking for what I thought were mopeds and we come home with dirt bikes. Neither of us had ever ridden. I got my first dirt bike when I was 47 and having a blast. dirt bikes because it lets me get away from people <laughs> and the group here this week has been fabulous the training will let me get a little further away but at home in California there are so many people that to be able to go out in the woods and spend the day alone is truly a precious gift so much fun. I've just had an absolute blast. I've learned so much. All the guides and the staff have been awesome and super duper helpful and friendly. And I think it's improved my riding. Stu, you're actually from the US. How does it feel to be wearing the Canadian flag? Oh, it's all good. You can't, you won't get shot for this sort of thing? No, it's a global economy. <laughs> girls out there thinking of riding, go for it. I know it's thought of as like a guy sport and a dirty sport, but it is an absolute blast and I've had nothing but very supportive and helpful guys and they all think it's great that the girls are out here riding. So come play with us. Mm -hmm.